If you're looking for info on DJ equipment, PA equipment, some of the very latest high-tech gear, as well as some great tried and tested budget equipment. Also, there's some info on cables, the odd software advice, headphones, DJ controllers, projectors and other visuals, studio monitors, the odd turntable, microphones, lighting. Please do like and subscribe and look at the uploads on my channel as there just might be something of interest just for you. Two uploads in one day. Wow. I just had to fit this in. I was meant to make this upload years ago, but here it is. Beginner DJs, I am trying to help you out as much as I can. These lights are the first items I purchased when I was thinking about DJing. I saw these lights and loved everything about them. The colors that come out of these lights, every color you can think of. I'm trying to focus on lighting. I picked up three of these. They are called Smartback Pro Lights. I picked up three of these. Somebody that was in events was selling some lights. And I thought, oh, they're nice. I just like the idea of them. That I could use them for so many different things. You know, parties maybe. And I think they wanted £180 for three of them. I never even knew. But when I found out how much... I purchased these maybe six years ago. Maybe seven years ago. These brand new were over £300 then. And I got them at a steal. I've got six of these now. I purchased another three through a classifier dad. I think I might have paid around 200 for three. But I purchased these before there were any of the vast amounts of these kind of lights about. I just thought these are serious. Many people were using par cans at the time. And these weren't really anywhere, anything like this, or they were very expensive. These are meant to have around, I think it's a 12 hour battery life. I am getting nearly 18 hours from these lights today. I think the thing about these is these were just built raw, rough and ready. They do the job. Metal body, not like some of the ones you get in these days with the plastic bodies. The lights that come out of these, intense, all the colours. That rainbow, these lights have got it covered. They got a foot on the bottom where you can angle these. But you clip that in or you pull that button out and you can clip an angle. There you go. In that menu, there are so many different programs. You can get these to do so many different things. I just, I'm telling you, go online and find out about these lights. I can't go through what they do, but they do so much. A nice wavy kind of light moving in from one light to another light and gliding. Oh, unbelievable. You can connect these up, use them on DMX. Look, it's even got an indicator telling you how much battery life is in there. Look, sound to light control. There is even a sensor there at the front, if you can see it, for remote control. Or glance on the underside, you've got power in, power out, DMX in, DMX out, and this foot that I'm talking about, got your switch on and off. The batteries in these are rock solid. I think some of the batteries in new equipment these days might be a bit cheaper, not last as long. These days, I don't think they want things to last that long. I want you to replace them. Try and get hold of these. These lights are amazing. I'm telling you, if you can find these, you're done when it comes to your up lights. Let me just show you what they can do. I'm not too sure how good the lighting is in here. I don't know about lighting, color correction, but there is every color, honestly. You can even go through the menus and you can tailor the color that you want. You can program one color and then you can shoot it to try and, you know, blend into another color so you can creep into another. They're amazing. 
Got that on the ceiling. I hope that might help. Uh, it's not the greatest, but vivid. The lighting from these is oh, it's so strong. It's best maybe to go online and find out everything you need to know. I think the good thing about these is there are so many of these kind of lights about now, and I think people are maybe looking for those. I'm telling you, look for these if you can, because these are very old. They're likely to be not very, a lot cheaper, but the quality is there. That's what I'm trying to focus on. You're getting a decent light here that's still giving decent battery life. I often use these for an event, turn them off, use them for a next event, turn them off, use them again and again because the battery bulletproof. Beginners, I'm trying to tell you to steer away from new lights. I've noticed that a lot of new lights, they're very expensive and the build and the quality isn't great, which is why I'm trying to focus on Chauvet 350s for your moving heads, Chauvet 355s. The 260s, not impressed with. I will do something on those later, but stick with your old lights. You're getting great prices. I think they were made better. The quality was there. I think the quality, you're losing it. These lights, they're not IP65 rated, so you can't use these outdoors. But I'm glad about that because there's no way I'm going to put these outdoors. They're going to go walkies. I honestly cannot say enough great things about these lights. Look out for them. They crop up every now and then. You don't, if you're paying too much for them, if you see them for too much, give them a miss because they'll crop up again when they're a nice price, honestly. These ones I purchased are Smart, Smart Tribe. I don't know what the difference is, but everything else I noticed is the same. And as I said, DMX programmable, you can connect two together so they can talk to each other and you can get them nice. Imagine these, or I use these in totems, glow totems, put them in there and they light up the totems. They look incredible. But the great thing about these, as you see, you can wire two up together and you can get them to talk to each other and light. But even better, this isn't even a DMX cable. Say no more. Thank you for watching.